Hello everyone, it really is a football experience to savour. I'm talking about a visit to the Stade Vélodrome. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And very excited to be bringing you live action from Ligue 1, the top division here in France. It's on Olympique de Marseille, and they take on Lille. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's how it looks for Marseille. Well, in this formation, the wide centre-backs need to be good all-round players, both in possession and defensively. They have to defend the box and also get out into the wide areas to cover the wing-backs. And so the initial 11 for Lille. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4-4-2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. And so the match is underway. Jonathan David. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Genghis Under. Payet. Could play it in. Defensive efficiency personified. Reinildo. Font with it. Mehmet Zeki Celik. Ikone. And a fine cross. Well, sadly, a bit of a tame effort, that one. And far too close to the goalkeeper. Valentin Rogier. They've regained possession. Good visualization and execution. Well, it was close, but offside nonetheless. Well, it's a matter of inches there, but he just went a fraction too early. Well, no stopping him. Bamba. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Well, they fancy a short one. Crossed into the penalty area. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper, but it didn't. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. Valentin Rogier. There to win it back. They've won back possession. Might be a chance here. Surely. Brilliant save.
Renato Sanchez. Bamba. Determined defending. And the counter looks on here. Options available. And he's made headway. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Burak Yilmaz. André. Still level here. But the pressure escalating. Well, possibilities in the centre, but dealt with efficiently. Now let's see about the cross. Well, a struggle to get it away properly. Slipshod passing. Now, what can they do from here? Matteo Guendouzi. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they keep it going? And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. And that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. And there it is, the half-time whistle. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Well, the attack showed promise, but easy work for the keeper in the end. Well, as you can see from those stats, they're just not creating enough. They need to play at a quicker tempo, get the ball into the danger area and get more players in the box. Make the opposition have to defend it. Chance to cross. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Sanchez. An effective challenge. It has to be! And the keeper more than equal to the task. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. And the substitution will occur now. Who can they pick out? Not all that convincing defensively. Wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. And increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Now, how about the short corner? Dangerous ball. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. And foul it is then. Can he make it 1-0? in there to take it away has a go and it goes well the pressure has been mounting and now they have the lead yeah. 
Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. Here it is now, a substitution. And so Marseille get the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? Not a good tackle. No high quality defending. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. Oh, maybe the equaliser. And up for grabs off the keeper. And still danger here. But no, the flag is up and it's offside. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Timothy Weah and that puts them in position and it's a double for him in this game no way for the opposition to contain him and no wonder he's off celebrating Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Well, a second goal for them here. How can he take them on and beat them? He must finish! And a fantastic diving save. Well, this has to be their way back into the game. The crowd are certainly playing their part. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And over comes the corner. Still not clear. Payet. Veering in field here. And he takes it away. Angel Gomez. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well timed tackle. Way up. And he's only gone and made it a hat trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. And so into the final five minutes. Botman. Andre with it. Weya. Could play it in. Well, still an issue here. 
threat over for now, it seems. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Is it going to be? Oh, a vital interception. Ikone. Well, there goes the final whistle and the big story here. Defeat for Marseille. Where did it go wrong? Oh, oh dear, Derek. That was a worrying display. They were completely outplayed in almost every department. The coach has got a lot of work to do before the next game.